earnings season isn't over yet. We're still getting quite a few companies and we always get the retailers at the end of earnings season. But this year, we're also getting the pot stocks. So I put together a list of the three big ones that are going this week. One is already reported, Aurora Cannabis. ACB is the new ticker on that one, it just listed. And, but we're getting three others that have already been around for a little while to see what's going on because this is the hot area. Does anyone care if they meet or beat? Let's take a look. First one out the gate after Aurora Cannabis will be Kronos Group. C-R-O-N is the ticker here. This one has only reported the one time so far since it's been uh, put onto the public market here in the U.S. And it was a beat, but uh, these are very volatile. There's very few analysts covering the pot stock still. I would say there's only like two or three analysts on each one of them. So it's going to be a little dicey with the beat or the miss here. Uh, they're still expected not to make a, uh, not to have earnings this year. Still expected to see four four cent loss in 2018, but a 15 cent earnings revenue gain in 2019 if these numbers hold up. So that's Kronos Group. Then we're going to switch over to the really popular one, Tilray. Everybody knows this one because look at that chart. It's crazy. Only went IPO earlier this year and has already gone from just over $20 all the way up past $140. It did have a miss on its very first report, but again, because there's so few analysts covering it, that's not a shocker. Did miss by eight cents, looking for a loss of 14 cents this quarter. Um, expected to see a loss for this year and for next year still so far with Tilray. And then we're gonna get off with Canopy Growth. Now, you're looking at this chart and you're going, Tracy, there's nothing on it. We had a technical glitch here, so I couldn't bring you the actual beats or misses here, but it did miss last quarter. Um, and it missed by 19 cents. So expect to see a loss of 12 cents this quarter, but things are really gonna turn around quickly. Fiscal 2019, expected to see a loss of 41 cents, and then a actual gain next fiscal year of 34 cents. Canopy Growth is the company that Constellation Brands is taking a big um, percentage growth in, you know, they bought a big share of them. So a lot of people think that this one is actually going to see some earnings as soon as possibly next fiscal year. So I just brought the three companies with this one because the fourth one is already reported, but it's good they're all grouping together in the same week. So that makes this week on the earnings calendar kind of exciting in addition to all the other companies that are going. So it's not just about retailers, it's also about cannabis this week. But I'll be covering the retail group and some big tech names as well, so you don't want to miss a single episode of the Earnings All-Stars. We still got a little bit of time left to go in this earnings season, so be sure to tune in. You can get all of our videos on Zax.com, also on YouTube, and you can find us on Twitter, but be sure to watch.